Hey guys, what's up? A very, very, very good evening to all of you, and I hope all you guys are having an amazing day going on right here today. And I hope all of you are having fun. Let's make it even more fun with this amazing class that we have for all of you. And what are we going to be doing today? Before that, if you guys are new here, a very warm welcome to Vidantu Young Wonders, and a warm welcome to my class. And my name is Mohan, Master Teacher of Science from Vidantu. So, what are we discussing today? What's up? What's up? Hi Arjun. Hi hi Anshika. What's up? Hi 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 Darpin. Hi Deekshita. Hi Kriti. Cool. You're very old. Oh, nice nice. I know you're old. <laughs> you're sleeping, but you woke very good, Tarika. Very good. And call up all of your friends. These much numbers are not enough at all. Nope. Not enough. Not enough. Not enough. Nope. Yeah. So people, if you're wondering, sir, did you have a haircut? I did not have a haircut. Lot of you guys were asking, no, sir. In this, uh, uh, in this thumbnail, though, you look a little different. But you have long hairs. Why is your hands, uh, your hair is not standing? I'm like, let's do it. Let's do something. So I set my hair properly today. So I'm not gonna disturb my hair throughout the class. <laughs> okay. Now I look like that person. See, am I showing it? Am I pointing it right? Yeah. Now I look like that person. Cool. Now, so today's topic, what are we discussing? Is we are in the chapter winds, storms, and cyclones. Now, this uh, class is all about understanding the destruction, effective safety measures of cyclones as well as tornado is what we're going to be seeing now, along with the live menti quiz. And I hope all of you guys are ready for the menti because it's going to be easy today, very easy. And this is the last class for this chapter. I I I hope that you guys have already gone through the previous classes of this chapter. Yes or no? No. If you haven't, then do it right after this class. So let's see how many students we have. Are we good to go, Computer G? Sixty? Yeah. Not enough. Call up, call up, call up everybody. Call all of your friends to the class right now. <clears throat> I mean, in this chapter, it's the last, right? Hi, Joel. Hi, hi, hi. So a big hi to all of you. You you got your new notebook? I mean laptop. Acha, nice, nice, good. Congratulations. Congrats, congrats, sir. I am from your classes. Oh hi, what's up? Chala, we'll start now. Yeah, good to go. All the interaction is done. Yeah, all feeling happy now. <laughs> sir, it's impossible for you not to touch your hair. I know, but I am gonna try not to touch my hair today. I am gonna try. <laughs> Thank you so much, beta. Thank you so much, Gurman. You call your friends, sisters, brothers, everybody. Oh, nice, nice. Hi, Rishita, new student. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> Chalo, guys. So we're gonna get started with the class right away. And here we have an amazing physics meme to all of you. Oh my God! Look at that. Look at that. That guy is <laughs> flying on a car, guys. Oh my God! I can't even show this one more time because I am getting irritated. So I am not gonna show it. Let's move forward, guys. Yes, today's beautiful quote. What do we have? Is we have hustle until you uh, you no longer have to introduce yourself. You don't have to, guys. You know, right? You don't have to introduce yourself. You go to. I mean, you don't see Shah Rukh Khan coming, and then uh, in in the middle of the crowd, he's like, "Hi, people. I am Shah Rukh Khan." Does he tell? No. Right, so you have to work hard. Hustling means you have to work hard until you don't have, to, you no longer, longer have to introduce yourself. People should know you. People should recognize you. ठीक है? Yeah, that's what. That's how much of hard work that you guys should do in order to, you know, become something like that. All right? Yeah, cool. You're the RG center. I know. I know. <laughs> Challenge: Don't touch your hair. Challenge accepted. Challenge accepted, bro. <laughs> cool. Let's see. But it's very difficult for me. But I am gonna try it out. Okay. I am gonna try out your challenge. I get ads on my own video. That is the funny part. That's the funny part. Okay. <laughs> Now I can see your chats. Cool. So we will start, guys. As you all know, here is my weekly schedule, which I am planning to change very soon. But as of now, you get to know. So today, this Saturday at 5 p.m., we have the ARP series. I am pretty sure that you guys have already checked out the previous episode of the ARP series last uh, Saturday. This Saturday again another fun fun session, uh, you know, for from the ARP series from a very amazing chapter. So make sure you guys do not miss it out on Saturday 5 p.m. 
Sundays is a fun day. So it's again at 12 p.m. You have an amazing, amazing class coming up. That is the last episode of the Cosmic Job Ka series. That last episode is going to be, you know, so amazing that you will get to know what you should do in order to become an astronaut. Don't miss that also. All right. Don't miss that also. Now let's move forward. Yeah. So guys, today's class, we are going to be understanding wind storms and cyclones, and we will be understanding about the destruction, effectiveness and safety measure. How strong can they be? What are the effective safety measures that we should have? And also what all can we do for cyclones as well as the tornadoes? Got it? Yeah, let's do that. Cool. Cool. How many? 75 watching 69. Huh? It's okay, guys. It's okay. See, you guys have come. No, that's all that matters. People who have missed the class, very sad for them. But you guys are here. No, that's good. <laughs> I will take the class even if one person is there. Da. You can't stop me. You think you can stop me? No. <laughs> All right. Cool. But you guys are lucky. You guys are here. Yeah. First one. The destruction caused by the cyclone is pretty huge, guys. It's not some normal wind. Cyclones ka wind speed can get so high. It's so powerful that it can, you know, uh, of make the trees fall down, make the buildings, you know, crack on. It's that powerful. It's that powerful. The waves can be up to three to 12 meters high. That means when these high waves hit the shore, they result in destruction of life and property to a great extent. So these water will definitely come inside the cities. And if they come inside the city, you know what will happen. Anyways, all our drainages are blocked. Just like how it happened in Chennai, all the drainages are blocked. Water has nowhere to go. Right. And it's going to stay like that. Got it. Sir, face cam chota kar do, please. Kyun? Kyun? Kyun kar? Nahi karunga. Thik hai? <laughs> Nahi karunga. Okay. That is how destructive cyclones can get. Got it, guys? Yeah. Now, the soil, what all the different types of destruction can we expect? Right. So the soil of the area loses its fertility after a cyclone. Why? Guys, the water washes away everything. Right. It, sometimes it can be salt water from the oceans and the soil can, can no longer grow plants if the soil is salty. Right. So the soil of a place where there has been a cyclone, where there has other water which came inside the you know cities, the plants cannot grow. The soil becomes infertile. Now floods appear if rainfall also continues for a longer duration. You can expect floods, houses will be flooded and your cars will be flooded. You will have to use Ola boats. You will have to. So it, I think it's better people living in the coastal areas to have a boats, boat always in your house. Right? So, <laughs> all right. Yes, because it can get that serious guys. Cyclones are not a joke. And also these high speed winds in the cyclone, they affect telephonic communication lines, they uproot the trees, damage houses and cause loss of life. Everything, every day to day activity gets stopped. Everything gets stopped. Sir, please don't ignore me. You don't ignore me. Da. I am teaching something. Don't ignore. All right. Listen to me. If I ignore you, it's fine. But if you ignore me, zero marks. So which one is better? Me ignoring you is better, no? So you guys, you guys don't ignore me. <laughs> All right. Appa. Ignore, 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 ignore only. What I should come and keep looking at you like this only then. <laughs> All right. So what are the other names of cyclone that we have? Uh, so in, uh, in India, we call it as cyclone, right? But in the different countries, like if you talk about America, they call it as hurricane. And if you talk about Japan and Philippines, they call it as typhoon. So typhoon, cyclone, hurricane. It's, the, it's all the same, but it just has the different names. That's all. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Now, what to do if you are living in a cyclone hit area? Oh my God. What can you do? What can you do if you are living in a cyclone pro prone area? It's, it's very, very, you know, important to stay safe. And how can we stay safe? Right. Look at that ponytails. It's so, so cute. <laughs> so how can we stay safe? Let's see. 
Let's see what are the different effective safety measures that we can take in order to stay safe during the cyclone. Okay. Yeah. First of all, get ready. Monitor alerts and advice from emergency services. Guys, cyclone alerts will be given 24 hours prior. As soon as possible, the, the you know, the, the, uh, the weather forecasting department gets to know, the meteorological departments gets to know about cyclone. They will inform everybody. You will keep on getting alerts in the radios, in the television, in, in your phones, everywhere. So make sure you guys get prepared for it. Check out the news. Check out your phone. Check out the TV. They might, there might be alerts. Right? Shut all the external doors and windows. Right? Shut all the external doors and windows. Gather family and review your evacuation plan. Think. Where can you go if things go wrong? Do you have a plan? Do you have everything packed? That is something which you have to have in mind. And shelter at home. I forgot to keep my phone on silent. It's ringing. Anup sir is calling me. I am not going to talk to him right now. We'll talk to him later. <laughs> okay. So we have shelter at home. So if you are if you are if you are planning to stay in the home itself, what are you planning to do? Remain inside with your emergency kit and bat and your battery radios. So keep all of that ready. Turn off the gas and electricity and unplug all the appliances. Like like remove it off. Next, move people and pets to the strongest part of your house. Yes, shelter means your house. So move them to a strongest you know strongest uh, uh, place. Not in the basement because basement can get flooded. Not in your uh, you know garage. So move them all to a safer place. Got it? Yeah. It's not. It's not a prank call, guys. I called him in the morning. He didn't pick up. Now he's calling me. Morning. I think I called him around eight a.m., nine a.m., ten a.m., eleven a.m., twelve a.m., twelve p.m., one p.m., two p.m., three p.m. He's calling after seven hours. <laughs> he's calling after seven hours. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Cool. <coughs> Next. So, follow evacuation plan and head to the nearest emergency shelter. Suppose in case if your shelter is not strong enough. If you think that your shelter is not going to hold or withstand, then you would obviously have to leave. That is 24 hours prior to the cyclone. So, have an evacuation plan and head to the nearest emergency shelter. Do not attempt to drive or walk through water. Instead, stay in the car with a handbrake on. So if there is a lot of water coming on the road, don't you know drive there. Next, can't take pets. Leave untied in laundry or bathroom with food and water. So if you're not able to take the pets, do not tie them and leave off. Right? Untie them. Pets, animals will know how to survive on their own in such situations. I mean, it's better to always take them with you. But if you have animals like cow, which you cannot carry on your head, in that cases, untie them, make sure that they are in a safe place and you can go because prioritize your life first and then everything else. Got it? Yeah, cool. Now, next one. Before cyclone, what are the different things that you can do before the cyclone? Ignore rumors, stay calm and don't panic. People will tell guys, people will tell. They'll be like, you know what? This cyclone is coming from space all the way from sun. All this Facebook and WhatsApp messages you, you, your, your parents get mainly in, in the family groups. The first thing <laughs> it will be written on that forwarded message. You know what it is? You know what it is? The first message. The first line in that message. <laughs> Warning. Emergency news from NASA. I'm like, where did NASA come from? <laughs> did they sometimes put names also? Emergency message from some actor's name they'll put right <laughs> from actor's name they'll put they'll be like okay uh, emergency message from leonardo dicaprio emergency mes message from tom hardy some some english name they'll put <laughs> and then like from nasa nasa headquarters and they like then the message will be there please stay indoors there is a, a cyclone coming all the way from the sun and your parents will not forget to forward it to everybody. You will get the message. Your friends will get the message. Your teachers will get the message. Your entire relatives will get the message. <laughs> Even the NASA real headquarters will get the message. NASA will be thinking. 
when did we send such a message <laughs> so make sure you guys educate your parents and tell them ki all of that is fake okay nasa never sends a text message da it they are not so jobless that they will type a text message and they will find your family group ha where is anshika's family group they will not send it okay <laughs> all right yeah cool now do not i mean uh, ignore the rumors that was the point of it next listen to radio watch tv read newspaper for weather updates yeah prepare an emergency kit with essential items for safety and survival like medicines uh, you know drinking water right all of that it's very very important next keep your mobile phones charged to ensure connectivity so if a cyclone is about to hit tomorrow don't play pubg or free fire or anything let it charge for some time da your mobile phones are are so powerful you know why they don't get rest only especially you guys you either scroll instagram you either play free fire you either play pubg i mean has your phone ever been on full charge i don't think so i don't my phone has never been on full charge because i work da i do all the work i don't play games but you guys only gaming what if there is a cyclone tomorrow huh what if there is a cyclone tomorrow then also in the i think even in the in middle of the cyclone when everybody people are running and going everywhere you will be playing oh come on come on bomb bomb put it bomb put it shoot one shoot one <laughs> right oh my god next so keep your phones charged very important guys next keep your documents and valuables in waterproof containers like your certificates especially your report cards which has your fail marks so make sure you keep that safe so every time you see your marks you can you can, <laughs> you can scold yourself okay so keep that that that's important okay keep your <laughs> all the marks which you have scored good no leave all that that is not required wherever you have scored less marks keep that keep that every time every morning you wake up see it see it and scold yourself <laughs> all right yes next Uh, 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 but very important, guys, because few of the documents like your Aadhar card, right? Uh, I know that you don't look look uh, like you are in the Aadhar card. Your Aadhar card is somebody's person. Some, it's it's somebody else, and you are somebody else. But still, it's important. So make sure you guys have those kinds of documents. Very much uh, important. Sealed in a Ziploc or a plastic con- container. Okay. Secure your house. Carry out repairs. Don't leave sharp objects loose. make sure if anything is loose in your house like if your roof is loose tight everything let not fly away so all of that make sure you guys do before the cyclone okay next role of technology in predicting and protecting from the protecting <laughs> predicting and protecting from the cyclone so what happens how do people get to know one of the main reason is guys the satellites and radars have made it possible to predict cyclones ahead of time so that appropriate precautionary measures can be taken accordingly so guys if you see from the space that's where satellites are right you can actually see the cyclone moving see you can see here they will be able to identify when the cyclone is forming they will be able to identify which direction it's going so if it is coming towards your direction they'll be like people living in chennai stay safe because cyclone is coming towards your direction and the speed of the cyclone is 10 km per per hour and they know they'll know the distance so if you know the speed and if you know the distance what can you find out if you know the speed and if you know the distance what can you find out batao jaldi batao you have the speed of the cyclone you have the distance for between the cyclone and the chennai you can find out the time taken so how much time will it take for the cyclone to reach there and they will tell us ki ha huh, in 36 hours the cyclone is going to come in 12 hours it's going to come so that is how they can give us the timings of the cyclones clear guys yeah so satellite plays a very very important role in all of this weather prediction reports clear amazing now we will see the destruction caused by tornadoes okay tornado is the same thing wherein there is a low pressure uh, point in the in, in in the middle and the winds go around it and when these winds go the the high speed winds roll over the slow speed winds 
once they touch the floor then the the, the tornado is created and tornadoes are so 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 bad so cool to watch but very 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 powerful guys <coughs> very powerful that they will lift they will they can lift houses they can lift cow right they can take the cow and throw it to to different places they can take you and throw it if you want to travel anywhere for free simple go stand in tornado you can travel to the next city so if 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 for example if tornado comes in bangalore if you want to travel to mysore or to tamil nadu you just have to stand there gone <laughs> but then surviving after landing is difficult but that is how powerful tornadoes can get this is a real tornado you see on the screen yeah it's real it's real all right yes now it uproots trees electric poles telephonic telephone poles it disrupts power supply and telecommunication if you are standing outside it's going to throw you out if your cars are outside it's going to take your car and park it somewhere else right if if you have parked it in the no parking zone it'll it'll clear it out i mean it's it's very powerful that people you know in, dif- in uh, i mean uh, fortunately in india we don't have tornadoes right thank god but the countries which get affected by tornadoes they all, most of the houses have bunkers so they go stay under the bunkers right so bunkers will be underground even though their entire house collapses they can you know stay under the ground clear very powerful guys very very powerful yeah next it lifts the people the vehicles off the ground and hurls them hundreds of meters away this may lead to the death of the people and damage to vehicle of course guys human body is so fragile right very very fragile that from from a small distance we fall down our body is like a watermelon it it can't handle it so once it once the tornado lifts you up death is for sure so it's that powerful very very powerful we can use parachute arjun nice 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 in the middle of the tornado you will go use parachute <coughs> right <laughs> guys along with see you are not the only person who is flying in the tornado you are flying your car is also flying there is the, there is a cow the cow is also flying imagine the cow comes and hits you on the face da when you are flying what will you do imagine the dogs are also flying dog comes and bites you when you are flying only what will you do <laughs> right so it is so it's it's very very difficult guys all right everything flies it, it can lift it can lift everything next ha huh. measures of uh, safety from tornadoes in tornadoes what all can we do now to protect uh, oneself in a tornado one should take shelter in an un- un- underground room with no windows there should not be any windows if in a room with windows one should close them and hide under the table or a workbench next one should bow down on their knees protecting their neck and the head using their arms so guys the main parts of the body are protected you are protecting the lower part of the body your head your neck everything is protected because it's important these are the weak spots of humans okay we have to protect ourselves now main important thing guys i can see i can already see a lot of questions coming up in the chat box regarding you know tornado can lift uh, tornado so a lot of different different questions are coming up so guys uh, you know if you want to know answers for all of that since i since there is a lot of lot of lot of you guys here and i'm not able to specifically you know point out all the answers uh, and answer it out guess what in vedantu there is 100% doubt solving all right i'll clearly show you. let's not go with the slides i'll show you what happens in my class itself i'll show you the proof okay let's go to my classes so i have a class at 5 pm these are upcoming classes let's go to past classes theek hai let's go to any one class uh okay these are all my midterm classes let's see if i so if you go to any classes first of all even if you guys miss out the classes no you will be able to watch the classes again by the replays that is something very special at vidantu and guys even if you uh, you know are watching watching a replay you will still be able to participate in the quiz you will still be able to participate in the quiz that's me yeah now also check out the doubts 88 doubts were asked 88 doubts were solved so 100% doubt solving happens in the class because you will be having me you will also be having a personal personal master a class teacher to solve out all of your doubts okay 
Now, apart from this, you can also download the class notes. You can click on get notes and those class ka notes will also be given right to you. So class notes ka problem solved. You'll get all the class notes. Now, doubt solving is done 100%. Right? What not, guys? What not? All of this is so amazing. I'm going to show you a few more things. Wait. Mm, yeah. Now, this time, exclusively, we have something called as Vedantu Improvement Promise, wherein once you guys take up the Vedantu, and if you guys do not have any improvement, your entire money that you pay for Vedantu will be given right back to you. No improvement, get the money back. Along with this unlimited live quizzes, fun and high level, you know, uh, very fun filled classes. So you will not come to the class and sit like this. So you will be always participating in the quizzes and all of that. All right. Next, you will compete with students throughout the world. Right. Next, interactive replays with live quizzes and leaderboards. So even when you're watching the replay, you will be able to see the quizzes and also leaderboards. You'll be able to participate in that. Now, premium downloadable content with handwritten notes of master teachers. I, 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 I showed you the, the notes. Free unlimited micro courses and free crash courses for boards and competitive exams. Oh my God. What not guys? By looking at all of this, no, we can easily tell that you'll be paying very less, but the amount of classes will be more. All right. More classes. Now let's see how can you take up this Vedantu course? All you guys have to do is go to my video right here. Click on the like. Subscribe to Vedantu if you haven't subscribed guys, because that is the motivation for all of us to keep teaching. So I, I've been noticing, I've been seeing data that most of you guys have not subscribing. That's very bad because if you stop subscribing and if you unsubscribe, uh, we will not be able to teach on YouTube. So don't make that happen. Subscribe. Okay. Yeah. Do not unsubscribe. Don't do it. Now, if you go here, you can see Vedantu Pro subscription ka link. Click on this. You'll be taken to a different page. And here you can choose any plan. We have Pro Lite, Pro Classic and Pro Premium. Now, Pro Light is something that I just showed you guys. Unlimited live classes. We have uh, doubt solving, 100% doubt solving, assignments and notes, test series and analysis, doubt solving during the class. Yes. But if you are somebody who wants your doubt solving to happen even after the class, you can take Pro Classic because in Pro Classic, you'll be having a doubt solving app on the mobile. So even after the class, you can ask the doubts and get those doubts clarified. Pro premium is for people who need a personal mentor always with you to help you with your homework, assignments, doubts, academics, non-academics, whatnot. That is for premium and the batch size in premium is just 15 people. Okay. Now all of these three are classes for all the subjects, maths, English, social science, whatnot. Now let's try taking up one of the course. I'm going to buy the complete course. The, look at the price. It's two, four, triple nine. But my by using my coupon code, which is MK Pro, everybody quickly spam MK Pro in the chat box. By using this coupon code, you get additional 10% off. Plus also you have zero interest ka EMI. You, you, have, you have all the other options. All right. Yes. Now, let's say in case if you are very new to Vedantu, you wanna you are very confused. Sir, will Vedantu work out for me? Will I be able to catch up? Do not worry because you also have a trial for one month. Click on the try. And here also you can use my coupon code to get additional 10% off. And, you know, start learning for a, uh, for a month. And I'm very, very sure that you will take up the entire course because it's lovely. You guys will fall in love. The classes are so amazing. All right. So try it up. If not, if not for the entire course, at least for one month, you will get, definitely get to know how cool Vedantu is. Right. So how many of you guys are planning to take up Vedantu? How many of you guys are planning to take up? So do not, if you're planning to take up, do not forget to use my coupon code, which is MK Pro. All right. Cool. Now let's go for the Menti. Let's go for the Menti. Menti, Menti, Menti. I'm actually class eight, but just came for you, sir. Please say my name. I'm Darshini. Hi, Darshini. What's up? <laughs> okay. So now let us go to the Menti da, menti. But by guys, if you're planning to take up the courses, take it up right today. Because uh, batches shuru hone wala hai. Hai? <laughs> so make sure you guys don't make it late. All right. 
just visit the link in the description in, or in the pinned comments and use the coupon code which is mkpro got it my hair is so bad right now i'm going to adjust it challenge is over no challenge is over <laughs> all right next so yes you can see the batch is starting very soon guys so do we also have olympiad batches starting so if you are planning to take up olympiads also you under the link you'll also have an olympiad link click on that again use my coupon code you will be able to join all right yeah <laughs> offer a premium batch is also starting very soon guys do not miss it out okay use the coupon code sign up right today check out the entire website it's, it's very beautiful website okay so the menti code guys 8022535 is the code for menti everybody join the menti right away and we will start the class 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 come on everybody <coughs> prank call please today the what is this guys it's thursday everybody will be taking classes i cannot prank call right now they won't even pick up challenge fail no it i it was an exception come on my hair was in the front <laughs> which class at 5 hame bhi aana hai nahi nahi bataunga ready 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 guys hi nipun hi anushri okay let's check out how many of you guys have joined the menti right away you know the code right mat let's go to menti The code for the Menti is eight zero two five five three five. Is the code for Menti? You guys know it, guys. You guys know it. Look at this. This is the code. Okay, eight zero two five five three five. Five three five. Come on, come on, come on, everybody. Sir, you are ignoring me. I am crying. Hi. <laughs> you are ignoring me, and I am crying every day. Don't ignore me, da. <laughs> okay vedantu lover vedantu lover forever wow sir is the what best thank you so much beta okay join and join in guys the menti code is 8025535 you are the watermelon kriti nice if 90% prank call please i don't think so da everybody will be taking classes we will do it on the weekends maybe on saturday On Saturday when we do the app series, no, that's at 5 p.m. We'll do it. Okay, so make sure you guys come. On on five on on uh, you know Saturday 5 p.m. All right, we'll do a prank call. Pakka. So are you a South Indian? Do I look like a South Indian? You helped most suit students. Thank you so much. Okay, so we have one not ten people joining the menti right away. How many of you guys are watching? we have we have one not nine people watching 81 likes you think i'm going to start the menti like this not at all nahi like like karo subscribe karo bell icon dabao <laughs> come on come on come on everybody you're the unicorn Come on, guys. Let's let's toss hundred likes and we'll start. Okay, don't be don't be conjus. I know you guys are not conjus, so don't be. Hit the like button and we'll start. All right, cool. I am your motivator. Nice. You guys are my you guys are my motivation, guys. It's because of you guys. And we also have nine dislikes. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Haters make me famous. <laughs> But why, da? I don't understand. If you don't like my class, don't come only. <laughs> Nay. डिसलाइक करके जाऊंगा मैं लाइक दैट यू गाइज कम टू माई क्लास नो आई नो आई नो आई नो बट माई यू नो वॉट राइट आई ओनली केयर अबाउट द लाइक्स आई ओनली केयर अबाउट गुड पीपल आई ओनली केयर अबाउट पीपल हु लाइक मी सो 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 स्वैक और एट गाइज सो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन ऑन द स्क्रीन फॉर ऑल इफ यू हियर साइक्लोन्स कैन बी डैश destructive useful both none of this cyclones can be dash <laughs> dikshita is like sir i liked in two phones acha thank you so much beta means a lot strong feelings yeah strong feeling it's c uh i think it's d none of this that's the right answer 
okay it's destructive of course guys cyclones can be destructive how can it be useful da i am very curious to know from you guys how can it be useful <laughs> read a word guys read a word okay so we have rishita at the top rishita is back on fire huh? nice dev love you love you to dev uh, apni if guys i'm not going to read it because i don't know if it's right or wrong apni chalti to duniya jalti oh apni chalti to duniya duniya apni means my chalti means if my thing works then the world burns jalti means burning no duniya means world uh, <laughs> i think it's a motivation something so good 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 yeah keep keep <laughs> keep chalting and make make it jalting always okay next we have nipun abignan aryan you block me from the chat i did not block you beta maybe you you would have uh, you know spammed so the computer ji might have blocked aryan so computer ji if you have blocked aryan uh, you know try to unblock him he's a very nice guy yeah <laughs> next uh, riya kasture uh, shubhra bhagwan ba bhagwan op in the chat <laughs> okay Abhay Rathor OP hai. Yes. Cool, cool, cool. Good job, guys. Next question, guys. Ah, uh, see, I am not blocking. But if you guys do something which is unacceptable, then you will be blocked. So make sure you guys don't do it. Okay. Oh, jalti means jealous, sir. Hey, but jalti means burning. No, no, it's not. Jalti means burning. No. Yeah, you guys are you guys are teaching me wrong Hindi da. jalti means burning i know it's burning burning also and jealous also hindi no this is why i'm not learning hindi this is why i'm not learning hindi <laughs> how can a same word have two meanings huh? <laughs> okay let's go for the next one i like from four id sir aapne mujhe kuch nahi bola nahi bolo <laughs> what is the best thing to do when strong winds blow over the hut having a weak weak attached roof open the doors and windows close all the doors and windows make holes in the roof burn wood inside when there is heavy winds out outside what should you do somebody is calling me in instagram you know video calling me in instagram so stop doing it guys i know somebody is from this class only is trying to you know <laughs> stop What's the right answer, guys? What should you do when there are strong winds blowing over the hut? This question is tricky. You should. You should open the doors and windows. I'll tell you why. Now this question was so tricky. Look at where the wind is blowing. Wind is blowing over the hut. Now let's say people, we have a house. Okay. we have a house where you have closed all the windows now all if you tell me the wind above your house is high speed so quickly tell me high speed winds are always accompanied by dash high speed winds are always accompanied by dash what reduced air pressure low air pressure so since there is high speed winds outside the house the air pressure outside the house is less inside the house the air pressure is high because you have closed all the windows now all if you tell me from where to where does wind flow from where to where does wind flow wind always flows from high pressure region to low pressure region so the winds inside the house it is going to push the roof away it's going to break the windows it's going to break the doors since air inside the house is trying to go outside basically your house becomes a balloon which is trying to blast got it that is the reason why you have to open the doors to release that pressure clear very good though people who got the right answers amazing da okay 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 <laughs> we have again rishita at the top 
देन वी हैव अपनी चलती तो दुनिया चलती ओके मनीष मनीष कालिया बबिता आदर्श वीर इनोवेशन निशांत सेवन आई अदिति पाल स्वाभिमैन 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 स्वाभिमन ओके हाई स्वाभिमन अनुष अनुष्का आई एम ओके दिव्यांशी गुड जॉब एवरीबाडी गुड जॉब ऑल राइट अंशिका थैंक यू ओके नेक्स्ट वन थर्ड क्वेश्चन इन थ्री टू वन यो वी गो स्वाभिमान इज सेल्फ रेस्पेक्ट इन मराठी इज इट सो नाइस सेंटर ऑफ साइक्लोन इज नोन एज वॉट आई स्फियर सर्कल नन ऑफ दिस द सेंटर ऑफ द साइक्लोन इज नोन एज वॉट नोन एज वॉट कम ऑन कम ऑन क्विकली वी हैव टू फिनिश इट ओनली फोर मिनट्स लेफ्ट The center of the cyclone is called. It's all long term, Kriti. It's all long term. It is the eye of the cyclone. Got it? That's the right answer. Good job, leaderboard. Easy question, though. Okay, so we have Rishita at the top. Same, same. No, Rishita, Manish, Kalya, Bhavita, Veer, Aditi, Paul, Swabhim, Swabhiman. अनुष्का अथर्वा सब सब्ट्रैक्ट टू कोनेरू सुहास ऑल राइट निपुन गुड जॉब एवरी वारी कीप इट अप ये कम्स द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन माय इंस्टाग्राम आईडी इज लर्न विथ मोहन ओके इट्स लर्न अंडर स्कोर विथ अंडर स्कोर मोहन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन गाइज इन फाइव फोर थ्री टू वन नाउ Cyclones can be dash high. cyclone waves can be dash high. How high can the waves be? Twenty to thirty meters, three to twelve meters, three to twelve centimeters. None of this. How high can the waves of cyclones be? Easy. Very very easy. Come on, come on. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I think it's three to twelve centimeters. this much this much no the waves are this high when cyclone is coming the waves are this high <laughs> it's 3 to 12 meters it was there in the slide also okay ha huh. oh my god rishita what is this is what happens this is what happens rishita has gone we have manish kalya rishita is back on fire huh? no i don't think so Abhignan, Bhavita, Shubhra, uh, Anshika from 8D batch. Hi, Anshika. What's up? Veer Innovation, Nishant, Savanai, Charita, Aditi Pal, Kriti from Jupiter. What's up, guys? What's up? Next question in five, four, three, two, one. Now, last two questions. Happy Navratri. Thank you so much, guys, and wish you the same. A cyclone is called a dash in Japan and Philippines. <laughs> Sorry about the spelling of Philippines, da. Okay, it's Philippines. It's not Pil. <laughs> Cyclone is called a dash in Japan and pill pens. <laughs> Hurricane, typhoon, both A and B, none of this. What is it called in Japan and pill pen? <laughs> pill pens. Yeah. Yes. So in Japan and pill pens, we call it as typhoon. Good job, guys. Good job. That's the right answer. Okay. <laughs> oh, so close again, Rishita and uh, Manish. You, you guys can do it. So Manish, Rishita, Abhignan, Shubhra, Anshika, Bhavita, Veer, Raya, Kasture, Swabiman, and uh, Srijan. Good job. Now comes the last question for all of you. In five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, guys. Come on, sir. You know Tamil. Tamil, tell me, Adra. Dash helps us announce a cyclone alert. What helps us to announce? I'm very sorry about the announce spelling. The satellite, stars, sun, and moon. Dash helps us to announce a cyclone alert. Okay, Shuman Bala is Manish Kalya. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Who's it gonna Who's gonna win? Do you know Telugu? Telugu, Kanchan Kudradu. Times up. So we have 
द सैटेलाइट्स हेल्प अस टू अनाउंस द साइक्लोन अलर्ट वो ओ मे गॉड नाइस वन और थ्री पीपल गुड जॉब गाइस सो लीड अबाउट राइट नाउ आई थिंक आई थिंक मनीष इज गोना टॉप सो क्लोज दो रिशिता सो क्लोज so close to but very good so we have manish at the top then rishita abignan subra amshika rai veer riya kasture srijan and uh, and uh, uh, bhagwan op in the chat so very good job everybody you guys have done amazingly well congratulations to all of you and if your name is not there do not worry because all of you know what the, all that matters in my class is the knowledge and the learning and make sure that you guys come for my session on the next the I mean the coming saturday 5 pm it's an app series and it's going to be from the office i hope so you know in the studio so make sure you guys come it's going to be fun do not forget put the reminder on right now only on your phone okay <laughs> cool guys so we'll definitely meet up in the coming class i hope you guys if you want to take up the courses use the link in the description and also use my coupon code which is mk pro all right so i hope all of you had fun we'll definitely meet up in the next class until then this is me mohan signing off all of you take care stay safe stay as lovely as always you guys bye 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 guys